Okay, so major leaks for Dokkan Battle from Team Dokkan are on Twitter. You all know him pretty well, I'm assuming. Uh, he put up a manga skit, a Vegeta. Memorable ones. A Vegeta essentially trading his pride in to be the bigger man and admitting to Goku that, hey, yeah, you're a better fighter than me. You're a superior being. Well, never really a superior being. I mean, like, he's still a better father than Goku, no matter how you slice it. But, yeah, essentially, he, follow he fired this tweet along with another tweet 10 minutes after, which was this. Super Saiyan Vegeta. So, from the looks of this, we are going to be getting an LR Super Saiyan 3, Super Saiyan Vegeta unit. Whether it's a dual unit, or, you know, something similar to Vegito, or it's just a unit where you swap characters, or whatever the case may be, this is happening. And we're going to get this. I am very hyped. However, I got a hole in my stomach now because of the fact that I only have 60 stones. So, it's like, I, I'm hoping Japan gets this first, I'm hoping this isn't global exclusive, and I'm hoping this isn't coming for at least a few, like two, like maybe two months. But aside from that, this is pretty damn hype. Um, as far as what he would do, who the hell knows? I mean, like, the thing is, the Majin Saga, you, you can tell they would do something like this because they want to make a Majin Saga category as, as tough as it possibly can right now. So that's why we have the, the Super Boo that came out already. So we have the LR Boo. We're going to have this. With the Boo Tanks, we have this. And we, we have a good amount of units now for this team. But this would solidify it as, as a, top tick, like a top contender tier-wise, depending on what he does. Now, I'm assuming this has got to be great. Because this was a very memorable scene. This was a very, very memorable arc. And this was a very pivotal moment in the, in the saga. This is the ending. So, as far as what he's going to do, no-brainer. We're going to have the shining moments where Vegeta takes on Kid Buu, essentially. We're going to have Super Saiyan 3's crazy, crazy Kamehameha wave from the ground up. And we're going to have the Spirit Bomb. The Spirit Bomb is... The, 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 the People of Earth Spirit Bomb is finally going to happen. And it's going to be insane. Uh, so this unit is probably one of the, it's kind of crazy because it shows how far we can't, we've can't, like, you know, came in terms of LRs. Like, we pretty much scratched almost all the important moments in DBZ. And we're finally here at the, you know, the fucking actual people's spirit bomb. So, this is going to be crazy. This is going to be nuts. I'm just hoping, hoping we get some more stones because they've been awfully generous with the stones in terms of the weekly login bonuses like 12 20 stones you know pretty generous not every day but the, the question is is what is this unit going to do and he's definitely going to support the majin category hands down without question um i just can't wait to see what it looks like it's gonna look amazing it's gonna look so good um sa save up just to save up. This is uh, this is one of those those tweets where you're just like, I'm not gonna spend any more on this. Vegito LR, I get it, but like, look, this is this is gonna be good. If you don't, if you have the boot tanks, all right, all right. Here's the thing. Depends on what you're going for. But if you have the boot tanks, I would save. I would forget about Vegito LR and just save and go for this because this is gonna be crucial. For the Majin category. I'm pretty damn sure. And only that. I mean like it'll, you could definitely run this on like Super Saiyan. A bunch of other categories. But my god. This is going to be nuts. I can't wait to people spirit bomb Cell. <laughs> and, 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 and Frieza. Like all that stuff with Kid Buu's animations. It's going to be so weird but amazing. Uh, it, it's... This might be one of the flashiest looking units ever if they pull this off. Given the fact that they've been on their game with animation. So, it, like, they recently just got on their true game with animation. So, like, they're going to do this justice. It might even look better. So, we'll, we'll, we'll just we'll just wait and see. I'm, I'm already getting hyped thinking about it. So, uh, yeah. So, these were the two tweets so far. Nothing else. Everything else was 7 deletion. 7 deletion? No. Epic 7. Never mind. 
So yeah, we'll uh, we'll just wait and see. I am I can't stress enough how hyped I'm already getting about this. I don't know when this will drop, but probably it's probably going to be part two. I'm assuming it's going to be part two. Uh, we'll we'll wait and see, but <sighs> let's just let's just let's just let it unfold. We should be getting a reveal probably by Monday. Probably by this Monday, if not this Monday, very, fairly soon. But this Monday, might, we might get the previews for this. I would assume they usually do this sort of hand in hand with Dragon Ball Legends, at least nearby. So, uh, Dragon Ball Legends will probably get the new banner this Tuesday, whereas this Monday we'll be getting a Dokkan preview. So, we'll wait and see. Anyways, I'm out. Uh, what do you guys think? I. I are you saving? I, I would save. I would save. Because this is a... It's kind of a no-brainer. These these units going to look amazing. I, I cannot stress enough. It's going to look crazy. And the fact is, Dokkan has been advanced way past the original anime in terms of animation. So I can only imagine what this is going to look like. So, yeah. I'm, I'm out. Uh, later.